Hey everybody, Craig Lighthizer here. In this video, I want to uh, show you how to use Google's Calendar uh, to be more effective and more efficient and save you time uh, in your DS domination business. So uh, with that being said, uh, I was just at the uh, Unit of Prosperity event in Atlanta, Georgia. Um, really a life-changing event. I uh, just had a ball. And one of the things I learned was Google Calendar. And I'm going to kind of do a video series of uh, just some of the things that I learned while I was down there. I'm going to share this with my team. And uh, this is just something that I did. I took this uh, training that I got in Atlanta. And I've never used Google Calendar before. But as you can see, I kind of set it up. I kind of color coded it a little bit. And I, I started it at 12 a.m. midnight. Midnight, I go to sleep. Um, I still haven't figured out why I've got this split box here. And then at 7 o'clock, I usually try to get up at 7. Sometimes I get up early, but I'm just scheduling it. And I schedule, and I get come up, get up, check my emails. Then 8 to 9, I shower and then drive into my work. I have a regular day job. And then I put uh, my work schedule in there. I come home. I put in a little decompressed time for a little bit of half hour. And then I start in with my um, the rest of my evening, and which I do listings and list and marketing I put down. Now tomorrow, or this is for Friday, for tomorrow. Today, I've got in about uh, 10 minutes this eLister Pro launch. I put it in there, and I'm going to list till I go to bed. Um, on Saturday, tomorrow, um, is Valentine's Day. I don't have a girlfriend, so I don't have to worry about that. Um, I'm going to put my sleep time in there. And then from 7 to 2, I'm going to record some videos, and I'm going to edit them from 7 o'clock to 2. If I get it done sooner, great. And you can see here, I'm putting in some leisure time. Um, I'm going to watch the uh, PGA tomorrow for a little bit. And then I'm going to start listing again. And then I'm going to work on my blog. And then I'm going to relax and watch, watch TV. So here's how you use it. I'm going to use Sunday. I'm going to do a Sunday for you real fast, okay? Uh, Sunday, you just kind of click on the time that you want to do it, okay, and then you can title your event. But what I'm going to do here is watch this. I'm going to take this, I'm going to hold my mouse down, I'm going to hold my mouse down, and I'm going to block that scheduled time. And then I'm going to go over here, I'm going to hit sleep, this is what I'm going to do for that time. I'm going to edit that event. I've been color coding sleep this, and I'm just going to save it. Boom. There's my sleep. Then on Sunday, I don't know. Let's see, Sunday morning, I think what I'm going to do, and like I said, I've just started using this. So what I'm going to do is Sunday. Oh, I'm having a hard time getting that right. But click this. And I'm gonna, wow, oops, why is my answer there? And from 7.30 to 2, no, nope, let's put it there, and I'm going to drag it, doggone it, I'm going to drag my time. From 7 to 2, um, on that day, I think what I'm going to do is because here I'm working on my blog, I'm going to actually go like this, I'm going to change this to, I'm going to, change this to yeah I'm gonna change this to change it to there to me and I'm gonna finish blog I've got to work on some blog post finish blog do blog post and I'm gonna create that event I'm gonna and then you can just go back if you want to edit that event. And I think I was using that green for that. So I'm going to use green. And then I'm going to go up here and I'm going to save that. You can see how you just chunk off blocks of time. And you just can kind of keep going through that and just grab, click and drag it to where you want, whatever time frame you want to do. You can edit your event. You can put it in a location if it's somewhere else. You can have it repeat if you want. Um, you can go on and you can share the calendar if you want, public or private. Um, 
I actually went in and created a whole new DSD calendar. But the, the thing I wanted to really point out to you is that when you're time management, you're managing your time, you look, you just don't have a lot of time. One of the things you've got to put in there is listing. And if you look during the week, you've got to schedule, you know, 10, 15, 20 minutes uh, at a time to, to get listings. So every minute of the day is valuable. And if you can spend 15 minutes and get three listings up, that's 15 minutes that you didn't waste. You got 15 minutes that you got listings up. So I'm going to take this advice that I got in Atlanta and this training that I learned in Atlanta, and I'm going to apply it how to use Google Calendar to be more productive in your DS domination business. So guys, uh, I hope that you uh, you like this. Click on my links below. Um, if you're a member of DS Domination, I hope you use this to your advantage. If you're not a member of DS Domination and you want to learn more about it, click on my links below this video and uh, reach out to me on Facebook. Uh, I'd like to get to know you, find out what your goals are, and uh, see if I can help you uh, achieve them. So guys, with that, I'm going to watch me this weekend. As you can see from 7 to 2, I'm going to be doing a bunch of videos. So uh, be on the lookout for my YouTube channel. Subscribe to my YouTube channel. And uh, I'm going to be doing some more fantastic training for this weekend. So with that, guys, have a great evening.